Previously on Danganronpa V3. There were intellectual sandwiches, cakes, and scones light up on the cart. Where'd you even get this shit, Kirby? I didn't have this stuff lying around. I made it in five whole minutes. What the fuck? What are you, Bionic? Yes, I am voiced by 2B, don't you know? Oh! Really? Can I see your booty booty booty? And now back to a new killing game. Help! Sneako B. Back with some more Danganronpa V3. We last left off, we completed the last few of the regular free time events, leaving only uh, just the uh, endings to the salmon mode here for each of these characters uh, left to do. Um, that, and we've also got uh, only four uh, love hotel scenes left. Uh, it's Himiko, Rentaro, Samugi, and Tanko. So, so yeah, it's my hope that I can try to get all that done in this episode. I, I hope so, at least. I think I can go through pretty quickly with the... Uh, you know, bonding with everyone to get to their endings. It kind of depends on how long their endings go on for. But yes, as you guys pointed out, uh, I was sort of right when I was saying before that Kokichi does actually see uh, Shuichi as himself, showing that he he loves Shuichi for who he is. Ah, oh, that was adorable. And goddamn fucking Korkio and Miyu shit. Just God, so many so many kinky ones. I feel like so many ones end with. Shuichi just getting freaking molested by these his classmates. But god damn it, Shuichi the just because of the, he's such a little buddy, he, he just puts up with it, all right? To make his classmates feel good, even though they're clearly violating him. Thank god I don't remember any of this shit, except for Kades. I'd be all right with that one. But yes, so after I uh, I finished all this, some of you guys were like, like Nico, don't forget about the talent uh, mode thing. No, no, I'm not I'm not forgetting about it. I, I just thought I'd finish this one first before uh, Moving on to that mode. Also appear to have only one uh, one other item here, and there's nothing left in the shop, so I'm, I'm guessing it's either from completing this, making everyone's ending, or uh, uh, in the talent mode or something. All right, Shuichi, you better not fuck it up this time. And didn't you get the fuck out of your classmates the last game? Well, actually, I'm pretty sure I fucked all my classmates. No, Shuichi, it doesn't count if you use the love key. You gotta get them all the way to that little gold area up there. Okay, so I figure let's go ahead and start with uh, one of the people here that I've I've already got sort of partway up there. All right, let's go. Let's go with Angie. I'll just focus on one at a time. Alola! What a surprise! <laughs> Perfect timing. I was looking for you. Would you like to get naked with Angie again? Please, please, no, Angie. No. Barbie just thinks I should just go to the same places again and do the same things again and again, but... But that wouldn't be any fun, right? I mean, gotta see a fair variety of each of each of these things. I guess. I, I don't know. It may, may not even really matter the location you're in, like, the stuff you do. Well, I know it does. It, it definitely does, because I remember one was like, the we were in the kitchen, the dining hall, and we are like, clean the dishes. I don't, And I don't know if, like, getting repeats, like, going at the same in a row would give you uh, less of a heart or something they wouldn't be as excited about? Pro probably not, but what should we do? It's gonna be the weirdest thing. Let's get our bodies moving. Let's clean up a little. I'm tired. I think yours is gonna be like, let's get our bodies moving, right? Huh? Huh? Something like some kind of workout contest or something? Atua says she woke out at night not during the day. You can't do that. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> How the dicks am I supposed to know that? You know, maybe I should just go to the same place with each one. Just to make my life easier. I don't know. Some of these are kind of obscure. Atua has spoken. Atua has spoken. Shuichi's gonna fuck me good. All right, so let's go to the courtyard again. I'll be curious to see if repeats do our detriment in any way. Okay, uh, fresh air. It's not that. Go for a run. Let's go back inside. Okay, she says work out in the night, so let's go back inside. Right, you. As long as we're stuck in this cave, being outside is no different from being inside. Come on, come on. In a conditioned room, it's like a paradise. Woohoo! Let's go back inside and I'll tell you all about the tour. This conversation went well. Okay, so wait, the run was better? I don't know. I, I guess I'll, I, I guess I'll have to. If I get this conversation again, I'll know for sure. But maybe some locations don't ever give you a like very good response or something. Tua says you should spend time with me again. Yeah. <laughs> you can only spend time with me, Tua says. So now let's go back to the dorms. Okay. That was the okay, but not the great one. All right. I feel like I might have to do a bit of a uh, safe scumming here to get these uh, last few love hotel scenes. So it seems I can definitely get repeats. Oh, God dang it, Monokuma. I know how to do this. You can stop telling me about it. No, Shuichi. I got to tell you again. How? This is how sex works. I know, I've had so much sex already, Monokuma. God! It's like riding a bicycle, alright? You never forget. 
All right. Uh. Oh, hey, all right. This is gonna be interesting. I don't have any idea what to expect from this. What kind of? Fa oh, I'm not even gonna say my usual spiel. What kind of fantasies does Rintar have? <laughs> Honestly, I have no idea. Wow, impressive. Oh, by the way, I, I, I'm actually meant to say this last episode. I, I said before, I was like, why didn't they get Johnny Young Bosch to, to voice Hajime? You guys actually told me he, he did voice Hajime in those scenes. He just didn't say anything like him. He changed his voice to make it, make, make it uh, a bit higher. And I don't really know why he decided to do that. Um, because Rintaro isn't the Hajime voice. It's much deeper. It's a much deeper Johnny Young Bosch voice. So he could have easily done the regular Hajime voice, which is essentially the Yu Narakami voice, you know? Which is also essentially Johnny Young Bosch's regular voice. But he decided to give him a higher Adachi anime sounding voice, which, I don't know, it just sort of confused me. That's kind of, I think that's why I thought it was a different actor. Mm-hmm, perfect. Looks like you finished all your assignments. Huh? Uh, assignments? What do you mean? What's wrong? What do I mean? The math book, Shuichi. You finished all of it. Math book? Could he be... My tutor? It's too casual to be a regular teacher. <laughs> That's why you're my favorite student. Good work, Shuichi. As he showered me with praise, he lightly tussled my hair with a smile. <laughs> good, good work, sport. Ah, no, you messed up my hokey. I got just right. This is part of Rintaro's dream? Can't break character. He'll wake up and feel awful. And then I'd feel bad. For now, I guess I'll just be a student. Wait! R Rintaro, I'm not a little kid. Even if this is his fancy, it still feels weird to be talked to like that. How should I put this? <laughs> Rentara, huh? Rentara's tone had changed. He's pulled his hand away, dejected. Not that long ago, you were calling me Big Brother. No. Uh, uh, was I? Oh, am I seeing... Is, it, is he seeing me as a younger sibling? My irritation seeped in my voice. Of course, I didn't know what he was talking he about. Huh. Guess I made you hate me, didn't I, Shuichi? Huh? Huh? Oh, yeah. Look, uh, I get it. I would be upset too. I've been your tutor for so long, but now I'm, I tell you I'm leaving. Leaving? How should I put this? And the fact that I can't even tell you why doesn't help. I don't blame you. What is he implying? I'm so serious all of a sudden. How should I respond? I don't fully understand what's going on! <laughs> what? This isn't like all the other ones where I just had to fuck them! <sighs> I know I'm being selfish, Shuichi. I'm sorry, but I want to shelter you from danger as much as I can. Huh? What? Danger? Yeah. Oh, whoops. Guess I shouldn't have said that. Forget it. Hmm. No, Rentar, I won't. Not with that look on your face. No. Some teacher I am, huh? Making you worry about me. Hey. But you don't have to worry about, it, about a thing. Nothing will ever hurt you. I will protect you. I promise. No one precious to me will ever get, ever get hurt again. Protect me? From what? I can't keep up with this fantasy! <laughs> Tar is an enigma. It's supposed to make sense as fancies are too. Wait! W wait, Rintaro! Don't really understand, but here it goes. Hey! That that hurts me, Rintaro. Thinking about you carrying this burden all by yourself hurts me. Rintaro's just trying to keep me safe, but I can't let him go. I'm... Maybe you see me as just a student, so you don't think I can protect you. But I don't want to be sheltered and oblivious to everything. Okay, so I... Hmm. First, I, was, I thought it was suggesting, okay, ultimate teacher or something. No, and then it's like, okay, still the ultimate big brother. Maybe he has a group of kids that he looks after, and they they call him Big Brother. But he's but he does uh, like tutor them and look after them. But but that, 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 that's actually yeah, that that's likely because I remember remember him mentioning that he, when he said he had twelve sisters, but a bunch of them were actually blood related to him. But he said he treats them. Uh, like his own sister, right? So, you're not trying to fuck me, right? You're not saying you want to fuck your sister, alright? Please? Or a sibling? Or someone you consider a sibling? Or is he just, is he just, well, if his alternate ability is that he's the ultimate big brother, that means that, uh, I guess his fantasy is to, is that idea that he's keeping someone safe and looking after them, right? But not necessarily sexual, I I hope! <laughs> Please, Rintaro, don't get weird on me, man. But I don't want to be sheltered and oblivious to everything. Shuichi. Remember. Rintaro, you're going to quit being my tutor, right? So I'm not just your student. I'm your friend. You can tell me anything. I know I can help you. You got me. <laughs> now, where did this come from? But I'm glad you don't hate me. Now, 
I can die happy. It's no use. Don't say that. <laughs> I'm joking. It doesn't sound like a joke. If he isn't careful, he'll die. What has Rintar got himself into? In any case, this is fantasy. And I'm with Are him. Are you sure about this, Shuichi? You're at the point of no return. I would never want you to face it alone, Rantaro. You've really come into your own. <laughs> All right, I give up. I'll tell you everything. Oh, by the way, you guys told me apparently the uh, the thing about Rantaro's ability that was it, viability is apparently its description isn't right. I, I pointed out last episode. I was like, "What the hell? My HP doesn't go up when I equip it." It's because the item description isn't right. Fucking localization team. But no, it's apparently supposed to be. Uh, that it decreases how much damage I take when I get an answer wrong. Ah, I see. That's actually a lot better than uh, what it said initially anyway, so that actually would have been pretty useful. Just until the end of this lesson, can we act like nothing's changed? The time that I spent as your teacher has been such a comfort to me. Yes, of course. I'll never forget the smile Rintar gave me. It's a smile I'd never seen before. Huh. Interesting. It, it didn't... No, it definitely didn't seem in any way sexual. Just a, like he was a caretaker and a teacher. So maybe the idea is Rantar does His ideal is just to be able to look after these, these people that he considers his quote-unquote siblings, right? Interesting. It does seem very likely that he his, his original ultimate ability then was the ultimate big brother. Which sounds kind of weird, but when you go into it deeper, it's more like he... Probably looks after a bunch of, of kids, teaches them things, helps them. Like, in this situation, he was clearly uh, a tutor for Shuichi and just takes care of him, I guess, you know? It, he's probably more like uh, what Maki's ability was initially, right? The ultimate caretaker. At least, that's what I'm getting from that. All right. Three left. Oh, is it morning already? I saw room Taro. Is that a dream? If it was... What a wonderful dream. Wait, did I sex him at the end? <laughs> hey, Shuichi! Oh, it's it, it, me, Gonta! Shuichi, you want to spend time with Gonta today? Gonta wears escort like Gentleman! Gentleman! Where Shuichi want to go? All right, let's go out and fucking do shit. Uh, let's go to the courtyard. Okay, his is going to be like running or finding bugs or something like that, right? What do we want to do? Want to just completely silent. That's pretty rare. Oh, oh, are we gonna do the thing? Are we gonna do the thing from, uh, it, they, I, me I remember from last uh, game, they had like those, like, shot through the heart things. Huh? That voice just now. Is that, is that Garner's inner thoughts? Oh, we are! <laughs> I totally, I totally forgot about those. Oh, they're bringing it back! Oh, here we go! Yeah! <laughs> oh, cool. Har harmonious heart. Okay. Affirm deny. Um. What did it mean to be true, gentleman? Gentleman earnest. Gentleman refined. Gentleman polite too. But go to think. Mm. Go to think. Gentleman able to do everything. Gentleman got to be quick-footed. Actually, I'm kind of curious. Can I lie with the? No. Got to got to be smart. Hmm. hmm. And go to really be gentleman? Seems deeply troubled by um, something. I think deny that he has to do everything. No V point, just go for it. Oh. Uh. Oh, there we go. That's wrong. That's wrong. No. Ah, cool. I'm glad they brought this back. I like that they, no. when they mixed in the uh, the original court gameplay for the for these sections. You know, I mean, it's a small thing, but it makes it feel like okay, this is this is a Danganronpa quote unquote dating simulator. I don't think a gentleman needs to be able to do everything. No, no, gentlemen can do everything. Gentlemen respected by community. Gentlemen, the smartest, strongest, nicest people ever. Got to hope he can be gentlemen like that. <sighs> Got to not feel confident. Bad enough, Gonta not like smart like others. Damn, this is awkward. Oh no! Oh, I fucked up. Shit. I'm sorry, dude. Gonta really tired. Don't know why. Gonta go back first. 
Ah, damn it. Wow, I'm really striking out today. I was trying to make him feel better. Say, no, dude, you don't need to try so hard. Oh, shit, I just realized. I think I might have uh, used up all those energy drinks. I did, damn it. Ah, if I save here and exit and... Wait, no. No, I think I can only buy them in this mode. I thought maybe if I go to the casino and then outside of this thing. No, I think I'd only do in this mode. Shit. Which means I'm only gonna, I'm only gonna have hang, to be able to hang out twice today. Oh, oh, Angie's in her thoughts. All right, here we go. Woo! <laughs> how should I fuck Shuichi today? <laughs> Shuichi, how can I get closer to you? I want to be your one and only. <laughs> because you are my first. No, no. You say I shouldn't pick a husband so easily, but... Atua says that's best. Oh, yeah. I know, maybe I'll give you a present. I don't know, I don't oh? know. Oh? So divine. Should I ask Atua about it? How divine! Yup, yup, there's no other option! Uh... Ooh, I don't know! Uh... It's gotta... It's probably a Tua, right? If I, if I ask for a present, she'll be like, I don't have anything to give you. A Tua's always good, alright? Come on! I agree! I agree! Ask a Tua! Well, perhaps you should ask a Tua! <laughs> <laughs> You're so divine, Juichi! Even a Tua's amazed by your divinity! How divine. If that's what you think I should do, then I'll ask him. Okay, yes. See, it's, it's always, it's always a Tua, right? It's interesting, though. She's actually drawing on things that we had talked about from our uh, free time events. I like that, you know? You were my first. Right? In other words, I was the first person to ever, uh, like, talk back to her, right? Because everyone on the island apparently always, like, treat her like a, like a fucking goddess. I like that. Shows that stuff carries over. Okay, I'm gonna, I need to buy more energy drinks. Why does it not let me buy more than one at one time? Seriously. Oh, here we go. All right. Shuichi, kick your pants up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is gonna be, this is gonna be interesting. I imagine I'll be like a fellow mage, right? Or maybe her master. Every time I come here, I play the role of their ideal, like some shared fantasy. What kind of fantasies would kid Himiko have? Her whole life is a fantasy. <laughs> okay. Shuichi, is your mana attuned properly for this ceremony? <laughs> I knew it. I knew she, she had to see me as a mage. Huh? Uh huh? Uh, oh, what? Oh, my. What? Did you skip your preparations again? What a useless thrall. Oh, am I your uh, protege? Ah, uh, why did I make a useless guy you like you my thrall? Uh, um... Your thrall? Like, from Warcraft? <laughs> I am the War Chief. Look, regard, no golem. Anyone that play a bunch of Reign of Chaos and Frozen Throne back in the day? You still don't understand. I explained it when I forged the contract. By thrall, I mean, you're my familiar. <laughs> and we get to fool around on the side. Oh, okay. I granted you a magical beast human form. In exchange, you serve me. <laughs> <laughs> so, so I'm an animal. In human form? Jeez. Ah, oh, you've forgotten already! You're originally a wolf! <laughs> what? I'm a wolf? Or maybe, maybe I'm a lion. No, you're definitely a wolf. This is pretty out there. Even for a fantasy. A final fantasy. Is Yumiko's fantasy to be an all-powerful mage? You. So is your mana tuned yet or not? Uh, uh, no. Um, not done yet? What was that? So you did skip your preparations. This calls for a punishment! Bend over, Shuichi! I'm gonna spank you! <laughs> huh? punishment Okay. Don't move. If you move, I'll use my magic to pull out all your hair! No, not my hokey! Do you touch it! Himiko took a few bold steps towards me! Her eyes brows furrowed. No! <laughs> what is she doing? Am I about to be a guinea pig for her magic? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> a boop! Huh? What? I look down and find Himiko burying her face in my chest. <laughs> I love you, Shuichi! <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, um, what are you doing? <laughs> this is your punishment! Wait! Whoa, hey! Go squeeze me tight, rubbing her forehead against my chest. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> ah! Ah! Yeah. It's like a dog or a cat rubbing against their owner. Kinda cute. <laughs> it's cause Himiko's so short she can literally only go up to Shuichi's chest. 
No, wait. Now is not the time to be thinking that. Um, uh, is this my punishment? That's right. That's right. I usually spoil you, but some, but sometimes your master needs to be spoiled. Go mumbled out, her face still nuzzling me. Didn't sound like much of an order. More like a child's pouting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hurry up. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Spoiler? Oh, maybe better head? <laughs> <laughs> ah, ah. Oh, I was right. She really is like a pet. <laughs> Behind the ears, Shuichi. Ah! And her little legs start shaking. Oh, yeah. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> oh, wow. All right. More. This is your punishment, so you need a pet me till I'm satisfied. <laughs> Man, you really remind me of Bernie right now. More? As it pet somewhere else? As if reading my mind, Himiko whispered. Okay. My back. No. Y your back? I don't know if I should. That's. Why? Huh? Are you going to disobey your master? Ah, uh, yes, that's right. It's just like paying an animal. Nothing wrong with that. Only half good. So I still have my hand to slide lower down to her back. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness gracious, Shuichi! Someone's getting frisky. <laughs> she really seems to be enjoying it. She like being petted. <laughs> <laughs> Make funny sounds when I pet you, Emiko. Okay, I think you might be liking this a little too much. Watching Emiko respond to my petting made me lose track of time completely. <laughs> I'm about to orgasm. <laughs> Wait, what? Without warning, Emiko's body went limp and she curled up against me. Are you okay? I managed to catch her before she fell, but just as I was about to set her down, Himiko's arm sprung up to wrap around my neck, embracing me tight. What happened? H Himiko? I know what you want, sweetie. Huh? Y you do? You're longing for the magical power I hold, aren't you? Uh, uh. It's okay if you want to do that. Suichi, I want you to stick your magic wand in my darkness! <laughs> Wait, what? I'm just a foolish mage who fell in love with her familiar. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, it's kind of adorable. <laughs> love? I'm ready. If you want me, then I'll become yours. Man, Suichi gets a lot of action. Ah. <laughs> uh. Miko's breath washed against my ear in a seductive whisper. <laughs> Felt like I was put under a spell. She's surprisingly strong for several, like being so little. <laughs> Get on the bench, you aching! <laughs> Chucks me down. I learned this from Tanko! Bah! Neo Aikido! Ah! Uh. <laughs> oh, that was kind of cute. <laughs> <laughs> Himiko just wants to j just wants to be pet. <laughs> Actually, I think I remember mentioning that before. Somebody, somebody pet my head. Why is the morning already? I saw with Himiko. Is that a dream? Yeah, definitely a dream. Totally didn't have sex with her. All right. Anybody gonna pop in? Here? Oh, Connie, let's do it. Hey, are you free? Are you free at the moment? If you want, we go somewhere together. Oh, please do, please. All right. Okay, then. Where do you want to go? Hang out. All right, I definitely don't want to fuck this up. Uh, uh, let's go to the library. Okay, so I hang in the library. Uh, oh, oh! Wonder what's wrong. Guy's in deep, looks in deep thought. Aww. Huh? That voice just now, is that? Is that guy's inner thoughts? Oh God, here we go! Not again. God, this always happens. I'm just so turned on by Shuichi right now, I can't hold my feelings back! I just want to rip my clothes off and fuck him right here! Yes, I affirm that! I'm always thinking about the piano. Even when I'm with Shuichi, of all people. I'm just, I'm so rude. No! Hmm. If only I were better at focusing on what's in front of me. Then I wouldn't be, the, be in this mess. <sighs> This is why everyone calls me Piano Freak. Aw. No, you're not being rude. It's fine. 
you are just fine. No! That's wrong! That's wrong! I fucking love you, Kaede. I love you so much. Please be the right answer. No. No, that's not rude at all. Um, but you wouldn't like it when you're with someone who's not paying attention. Because I know that you love piano, Kaede. I would never tell you to stop thinking about the thing you love. <laughs> Thanks. But I'll try to think of other things when I'm with you. But... Kaede, really? <laughs> no, I'm serious. When I'm with you, I want to focus on our time together. together. I think this conversation went well. Oh, interesting. That... Is it conversation went well? I don't think that was the, the super good one, though, either. So I, I could actually get that here, too. Okay. So there's a... It seems like there could be a bad response, a, a good response, and a very good response. So maybe there was a better one than that. That was enjoyable. Why do I have so much fun hanging out with you? But you know how to make it fun for other people, Shuichi. Uh. Alright. Aw. Uh. Oh my god, I ship them so fucking hard. I love it. Yeah, it didn't go up. Okay, so so if you if you get it right, if you get like a if you get a great one, right? Where they're like, I think it's cover I think this went really well or something, then you'll get one hard. And if you get less than that, you don't. I'm hoping you can't accidentally like go backwards. Okay, uh, in the courtyard. I've gotten I've gotten used to being here. I want to get outside as soon as I can. Staying here forever wouldn't be so bad. Oh, that absolutely that. Cause Atua, Atua thinks so too. You and me should start a happy family. Though I've missed my island and its people, this place isn't too bad. Uh, no one tries to stop my rituals or say says blasphemies like Atua doesn't exist. And then? And plus, I have you. Yeah. Yeah. The more I think about it, the better it sounds. All right, I knew it had to be that. Come on, that was her whole plan in the the main story to begin with. All right, only need to get one more heart, and I think she is maxed. Kazatua says so. Oh, wait, what? We didn't actually. Oh, okay. We came here and we just we made a game out of digging and filling holes. Spatel me again. It seemed like that was the. So maybe I don't get a choice sometimes? I'm so confused. This thing keeps like throwing me off. So that time I didn't actually have a choice. Maybe, maybe I've just gone to the courtyard too many times. What? What the hell do you want, Shuichi? Yeah, she's almost there. We played around, sing down, staying up quickly. I think that is it. I think you have a limited number of... So it's actually better to go to other places because... Yeah, okay. It's probably... So you'll get the... Uh, this, this is the good response, but not the very good response. So I've, I've used them all up here, I believe. But fortunately, I think that actually might be it for her. All right, who we got? I got two people left. Akibo again? God, how many times I gotta fuck you, Kibo? Jeez. You know what? I'm just gonna go with it because I actually have a spare one anyway. This will just help me get closer with him to for his ending, so might as well. Man, Kibo really likes fooling around with me. Is Angie maxed out? I I think so. No, yeah, that's, she's she's done. Okay, so she's. Cause we're at, it's, it's five blue hearts and five of the pink hearts, um, and that's probably it. All right, in that case, oh hey, what the hell, Kibo? You didn't go up any higher. I can tell you weren't into it last night. God damn it! That's because we had sex already, Kibo. Jeez, how many times are I gonna fuck you? God, it really was a waste of my time. All right, Kibo, fine. We'll hang out, out here instead. Oh, Suichi, if you have free time, let us go do stuff. As long as it's not robophobic. Okay. Uh, let's go to the AV room. Okay, uh, oh, he was completely silent. Here's their thoughts. How am I doing this? I'm ready to ask you questions. The professor said he didn't, he didn't mind. The notion that someone wouldn't mind being hurt by another. Is such a thing even possible? Well. No, there's no use worrying about it. Because only the professor knows the truth. Hmm. Still, if I had someone I could talk to about this, Maybe if I talk to Shuichi. But if I go to him with this, it might just bother him. No, dude, you can trust me. Uh, I think a firm. I agree. I agree. Talk to me, Shuichi. Or I mean, Kibo. Okay. Kibo. I don't know how much I can really help, but I could give you advice if you'd like. Actually, I hope you do. I don't want my friend worrying about stuff like this. Well. Thank you but that is no longer necessary. Huh? What? I... The reason I was able to befriend you is because the professor raised me, right? Uh, okay. That's true. But what does that have to do with getting advice? It means... I'm very lucky to have a friend like you, Shuichi. If the professor really resented me... That's right. 
he would not have raised me to be capable of feeling these emotions. That's why he doesn't resent me. I know that now, thanks to you, Shuichi. That's Kibo. Shuichi. When we leave this place, I would very much like to introduce you to the professor. I am certain he would take a liking, liking to you. This conversation went well. Okay, again, not the, the really good one, though. We got action movie, a comedy movie, and an anime movie. Uh, probably not an anime, because he'll probably be like, is it because I look like an anime character? <laughs> or maybe not even an action movie. Maybe a comedy? That's right. I do enjoy comedy movies. I enjoy them because they entertain people without being pretentious. I, I hope someday to be just the kind of robot who makes people smile, just like comedy movies. All right, I, ah, God damn it. Still just, I think it went well, but it could have been better. This is gonna take some work. Uh, okay, we got, let's read a dirty book. <laughs> let's read manga. This is boring. I think he would probably not like the dirty book. Let's read a manga? Yeah. Ah, yes, that is a good choice. Whether it's male-oriented manga that depicts battle on every page, or female-oriented manga that delicately captured the, the experience of falling in love. You know, our current predicament is like something out of a manga, too. Maybe we could commission Angie to create an excellent manga about us. Yes, all right. Got a very good one. Maybe he actually would have liked to watch an anime then. Thank you very much. I enjoyed myself today. I almost regret that we must return to the dorms. Would you spend time with um, me again? When I'm with you, my chest plate feels warm, and I feel I'm filled with serenity. <laughs> I love you, Shuichi. Uh, okay, let's go back to the dorms. <laughs> Ah, oh, you're such a little cinnamon bun too. God damn it. All right, who we got? Please don't be Kibo again. Uh, ah, it's me Kikichi again. Uh, it means you have to reload it. Now I'm starting to get the repeats. Oh, Cody again, yes! Ah, uh, but unfortunately I've already seen it. I'm sorry, Cody, I still love you. Hey, here we go, all right. <laughs> Tanko, okay, I, I feel like the only way this is gonna work is that you see me as Himiko, or a girl. Not a degenerate male. Every time I come here, I play the role of their ideal. Some sheer fantasy. But Tenko hates men. What am I getting myself into? Hmm. Hmm? Whoa, what's going on? Huh? Huh? What do you mean? Listen up. Brother Shuichi, please explain. Huh? Brother Shuichi? What's wrong? Hmm? Why do you look so surprised? Oh, uh, well, I'm not your brother, so. No. Yes, you are. As comrades of the Neo Akito art, our bond is thicker than blood. You are my senior disciple. I take much pride fighting alongside you. You're different from the degenerate maggots around here. You're amazing. <laughs> okay. It's like there's just a few males in her life that she's okay with, or just she just doesn't even really occur to them that they're also that they're also males, like she did with her master. Ah, so that's what this fantasy is about. Well, at least I'm not getting it thrown. <laughs> anyway, brother, what's going on? Huh? I don't know what you mean. I, I already told you. You can do anything you want to me today. <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> I. What? Did you hear me? I said you can do anything you want to me today! Ah! I, I'm sorry, I. Is this something we agreed to? You gotta be kidding me! Yup! When you won the sparring match, we agreed you could do anything you want to me! We fought under those conditions, right? <gasps> if I won, I could do anything I want to you! But there was no chance of me winning! Your immense strength can match even masters! I won against Tanko? Damn, I'm Diesel. Only a dream, I suppose. Tanko would never lose to a man. Unless, well, in any case, she said I can do what I want. It's not Tanko's fantasy. We have that kind of relationship? Listen up! Right! Right here, right now! Let's get started on our bet! But why aren't you doing anything, anything to me? My body is ready! Throw me to the ground! Neo Ikea style! Bah! No. Uh, well, that may be the case, but I couldn't ask you to- That's amazing! Oh, so wonderful! I didn't used to that, Brother Suichi! You're nothing like this degenerate male, so only fantasize about sex. Yeah. Listen up. Didn't they review me as your precious little sister? I am truly honored. But a deal is a deal. I took on this challenge with all my soul, as the ultimate Aikido master. You must accept the outcome and use your rights, fair rights, as the winner. Uh, um... But I, I don't understand. What am I supposed to do? What do you want me to do? I'm ready! No buts! Be a man and do whatever you want with me! She's serious about this. <laughs> she really is a competitive girl. But... Tanko, I can't do anything to you. Besides, if I can't do anything, that means I can do nothing, right? G you are so noble. I respect you for that. Damn it! But now I'm, I'm angry! You're an insistent degenerate male! <laughs> Make up your mind! I'm a what? D don't you get it? I, I, I'm ready! 
I really want you to do whatever you want to me. Huh? <laughs> Fuck me, Shuichi! <laughs> you do? Listen up. I challenge you because I love you. I made a bet with you just for that reason. Huh? <laughs> what? Ah, <laughs> uh, I knew it. You had no idea. <laughs> well, this is really surprising. I thought for sure she would see me as a woman. Uh, okay. Uh, no, I, I didn't. <laughs> ah, ah, I knew it. Your, your only love is Dio Aikido. Why? I tried so hard to get you to notice me, but you never looked my way. That's why. This is the only thing I could do. I'm sorry. Yeah, I can't. Tanko, I, I'm sorry. No need to apologize. I'll accept this as punishment for my foolishness. But, um. Take a look down and huffed it and out of breath and shot her eyes up at me. Brother Shuichi, I, I, I love you. <laughs> I said it. I can't believe I finally said it. I'm almost positive that you already did. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's what I thought too. All right, Shuichi. From now on, no more insensitivity from you, okay? Okay, but only if you can stop drooling. <laughs> Shuichi. That's true. Fuck me with your Neo Aikido! <laughs> I'm completely serious. I want to be yours. And yours alone. Oh, this feels so weird. This feels so weird with you. So, brother Shuichi, if you ever want to, you know, you can do anything you want to me. Anytime, any place. <laughs> and I'll be ready. Wow. Uh, what if we're like in public and- No! I don't care. It doesn't even matter if there's a whole bunch of people around us. Right there. Monkey Switchy. That's it? That's the end of it? Oh, snap. Okay, so we did anyway. <laughs> well, might as well get some before I wake up. Wake up again, like always. Because that's how Shuichi do, baby. Mm -mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Is Mario ready? That's not with Tanko. Is that a dream? First thing about a brother. Ah, oh, fuck me. What have I done? Uh, let's get some fresh air. Let's go for a run. Let's relax in the sun. Probably not a run. Either air or relax in the sun. Um, let's get some fresh air. Yeah. Yes, it's bad for one's mental health to stay indoors all the time. It's good to breathe fresh air, even if it's just for a moment. Shuichi. Do you feel it? Can you feel how overjoyed your air filter must be? You say that. No, I don't. <laughs> oh, good. We saw a lot of fun, though. Yeah. Shuichi! Uh, for some reason, I feel really far today. You want to go around and do some weird shit? Guess I can spend time with you if you really want. Eh, where should we go? Let's go on a magical adventure. It's a hand navy room. Oh. <laughs> ah, she's in deep thought. Yeah. Huh? What's just now? It's her fucking air thoughts. What is Himiko thinking now? Why does everyone keep getting it wrong? <laughs> I told them they're not tricks. Are they teasing me? Aw. Or... Do they really think I'm just doing tricks? No. Aw. <laughs> no. That's not possible. Even if I think about it magically. The truth is hidden in darkness! <laughs> Aw. No! Deny! I don't think they're tricks. I think they're real magic! No. Th no! It's not a trick. You do real magic, right? Not tricks. Mm. Huh. I'm glad you finally understand. Ever since I got here, everyone's been all trick this and trick that. So, I started to feel insecure. Jeez. Oh, Jeez, how can I let myself get like this? You know what I think I'm most curious about is why no one's freaking out that I'm literally reading their fucking mind. Cause I'm a mage. From now on, I'm going to proudly tell everyone that I use magic! Guess you're pretty self-conscious about that. Alright, yeah, a lot of fun, baby. Woo-hoo! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, I had a good time today, Shuichi! I had a lot of fun today! Our magic resonates pretty strongly! Yeah. I can gain some good mana spending time with you! I like Chibika. I think she's funny. <laughs> oh yeah, how about you give me a piggyback ride back to the dorms? <laughs> I don't know. I just think she's funny. 
It's a little bundle of energy. Put a smile on your face. Huh, that's interesting. I got her really good with Himiko, but she didn't go up uh, hard at all. Actually, I think about it. I had her love hotel scene too, and it didn't go up. I don't totally understand the mechanics behind some of this. What? Wait, wait, what do you say? My goodness, Kukiji makes the most insensitive, insensitive remarks about robots. That boy is in desperate need of a proper education. His robophobia is palpable. Let's cook something. Let's eat candy. Let's drink something. He can't actually eat food though, right? Uh, so can we drink something? Like an oil or something? But I must decline. For future reference, please keep in mind that I cannot consume food or, food or beverages. <laughs> oh, God damn it! Oh no, it, it must have been, it must have been food. Ma co cook something, I, I guess. Or maybe I shouldn't have brought him here at all. Maybe there's some locations that certain characters just don't do well with. I'm hoping. Oh, actually, I'm kind of curious. Did, did he step backward? Please tell me he didn't. No, he's still there. Okay, good. Don't be a dick, Donnarupa. Uh, let's study. I'm getting sleepy. Sure is dusty in here. Sure is dusty in here. I understand. Then I'll expel warm air from my mouth to blow all this dust away. This will kick up a, a lot of dust clouds, though. It might be best if you vacated the premises. Here I go. Uh... <laughs> yeah, yes. All right. I had a feeling like something he felt like he could do to help. All right, good. All right, all we have left is uh, Sumugi's love hotel scene, so... Hopefully I can get it without too much trouble. Yes, there we are. All right. All right, this, it, it'll probably just Samuki as the ultimate cosplayer, regular, not crazy Samuki, I imagine. Otherwise, it'd be kind of a spoiler if I end up getting this earlier on, but I don't know though. Maybe, maybe we will get little hints at her sort of insane side. Did I come here to play the role of their ideal? Like some sure fantasy. What kind of fantasy does Samuki have? Hey. <laughs> hey, hey, sweetie! <laughs> uh, um, sweetie? What's wrong? Huh? What if I called you big brother? Well, I don't wanna. You don't wanna call me little sister, do you, sweetie? Big brother? Little sister? Uh, what is going on here? Jeez. Don't be nervous. I'll still call you big brother in front of mom and dad. If they found out about us, I wouldn't be able to be with, wouldn't be able to be with you. Uh, it's like some story from a light novel. Actually, I'm almost wondering, is this even, like, fake to her, though, right? What is even this supposed to be? <laughs> These fake situations, is this, like, it says she set everything up, right? Shouldn't she be aware of this whole thing, too? My parents remarried, and I got a brother, and I fell in love with him. Huh? What? what? Uh, oh, my God, incest! Actually... Well, sort of. Never thought that plain old me would be in such a flashy role. It's perfect, just like the big brother root in the dating sim. Or I guess it's more like the little sister for you, huh, Sweetie? I see. So that's what's going on. It fits Samugi, but it's a little heavy. <laughs> that's heavy, man. Yeah, heavy metal. <gasps> but I don't like you just because you're my brother, Sweetie. Falling in love with someone who just happened to be your sibling. It's a popular cliche. I think I'd end up experiencing it myself. That's Samugi. Ah, <sighs> uh, don't call me that, Sweetie. For lovers, we should have nicknames for each other, right? Sorry. Uh, sorry. This is still weird. No, I'm sorry. I feel off today. It's plain to see I'm being negative. It's plain to see! Oh, good to see you still use your favorite word in here. What's gotten into um, me? Times like this, I need you to cheer me up, sweetie. Hmm. Cheer you up? How? What? Huh? Don't ask me. I don't have experience in this sort of thing. Um. um so how about you? Put your hand on my cheek. Uh, okay. All right. I can do that. So I was told I cut Sumigi's cheek in my, my palm. Sumigi sighed and covered my hand with hers. Ah, that is so embarrassing. Uh, Sumigi released a deep breath and watched me closely through her glasses. It's such a seductive gaze. I almost forgot to breathe. Oh my god, I almost forgot how big her tits were. Hey. Oh god, I remember flashing back to that psyche taxi. Which was on that billboard, ah! Your hands are surprisingly big, Shuichi. I wonder if your pantsahoge is just as big. Why do you guys keep calling it that? Uh, you think so? What's wrong? Huh? What's wrong? It's plain to see you're embarrassed. Well, it's just that you say things like that, it feels as though we're real lovers. Aww. You don't think we're real lovers? So his countenance shifted to a look of foul scorn. Like I thought. So, you can't see me as anything more than your little sister? Are you just humoring your little, your silly little sister by pretending to be her lover? No, no, that's not it. Excuse me, his expression was inscrutable. She pulled my hand off her cheek, Ugh. then 
Whoa! <sighs> Slid my finger into her mouth and starts sucking. Oh! <laughs> ah! Wait! Ow! What are you doing? Lost my composure completely. Yanked my finger from her mouth. <laughs> Try to think about the fading warmth, the saliva cooling as it dried, lingering. Oh okay. <laughs> god! Was that a little too bold? But if I didn't take it that far, you wouldn't realize. Realize what? How fucking crazy I am, Shuichi! I want you to make me your real lover. What? I want you to fuck me in front of this whole live studio audience! I want to become one with you. I want us to feel everything together. She bat her eyelashes at me in a way that was impossible to misinterpret. Her eyes, her lips, her body. They begged me to take her. I like you, Suichi. If I ignored these feelings just because we're siblings, I'd regret it the rest of my life. That's how much I like you. Ah, oh, God damn it! we're pulling a Kyo here. <laughs> then Kyo comes in, he's like, did I hear incest? More like wincest. Am I right, Shuichi? High five. No, dude, N no. Don't you compare this to that. Her lips a smile, she sauntered toward me. She spoke slowly, letting every syllable sink in. I love you, Shuichi. I want to suck your dick, Shuichi. <laughs> Whoa, what? <laughs> like her voice had wrapped around my brain, caressing it. Ugh. Couldn't help it. She had me. Oh, yeah! Fuck me like a monkey, Shuichi. Why is it always like a monkey? Ah, oh, we did it, guys! We've, we have successfully fucked every one of our classmates! I'm proud of us! <laughs> we did good! <laughs> oh my god, it's morning already! So maybe it was that a dream? If it was, I'm still feeling in my pants! Okay, alright! They're all done! Now I just gotta focus on these guys. Uh, what a great view. Let's dance, let's go back inside. What a great view. Well then. I shall use this view as an inspiration to pen a haiku. I used to watch the professor write haikus. I always dreamed of writing one someday. The sound of silence seeping into the robot. Cicadas cry out. Um, how was that? I don't think about poetry. Yeah, all right, kick ass. All right, I believe with that I am uh, good to go with Kibo. Yep. All right, let's work on... Let's do, let's do Miu next. That ought to be interesting. All right, let's go to the AV room. We gotta go. I know it's gonna be one where we watch some porn together, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, let's go to the bathroom. Let, wait, 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 let's go to the bathroom. Let's try to find a dirty movie. We should focus on reality, not movies. No, fuck that. Uh, let's go to the bathroom. <laughs> I'd probably be into that too. Uh, let's try to find a dirty movie. <laughs> you would say that, you fucking chode. What you think about? Think about for half a second. <laughs> Got a busty beaten. You just stand right here. Real woman's way better than a fake one. Don't tell me you get off a of fake shit. <laughs> what? Are you serious? That was the right response? But the way it was going, I was like, okay, I clearly got that wrong. Nope, that was the best response. <laughs> you stupid fucking slut. Oh my god, all right. I was like, shit, I fucked up. Nope. I didn't know one of them had to be find a fucking porno. I just fucking knew it. Suichi, me, you make a porno. <laughs> let's go to the dining hall. Okay, let's let's cook something. Let's bake something. Let's drink something. Uh, maybe bake something. She'll think it's like drugs or something. <laughs> oh my god. If I won't taste my sweet, sweet hair pie, huh? <laughs> oh god, that's right. I forgot she made that. She cooked the pie. <laughs> she cooked the pie with her hair in it. Oh. Ah, I bleh. Guess they blame me. That's what you want. I'll gladly serve it up, boy. Oh, bro, because this pie of mine gonna come in courses. Yeah, we, had, we both had a lot of fun, even though I was choking on that shit. <laughs> yeah, you died, Switchy. Woo! Yeah! Me, you and her thoughts. All right, what we got here? Man, I just want to suck his dick. Why would you let me do that? David, what should I do? Why did I think this is, why did I think of this invention? I really, really, really want to make it, but I'm pretty sure he'll be creeped out by this one. Maybe I shouldn't go through with it. <laughs> but I think Shuichi will understand. Out of my way. No, I want Shuichi to understand, little bitch. I don't care what anyone else thinks, as long as he understands. <laughs> But if he's creeped out, <laughs> oh, I'm just being surprisingly self-conscious right now. I'll understand, okay? I 
agree. I understand. I don't know, Mash just said no to being creeped out though. I don't know, this this might be the good one, but not the great one. Leave it to me. If you care about me that much, then of course I will meet you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, if you wanna know that badly, I'll tell you, boy! You know. Name at least bitch you're working on is Perp deal now, boy! The per the perjector! <laughs> It analyzes the user's subconscious perverted fantasies and projects them onto film. Once finished, you can be my guinea pig. Then again, I already know you're into the tattered old ladies with big old titties. I am. Yeah, oh, okay, that was the one. <laughs> oh my god, I am just knocking out of the park with Mio here. Uh, what a great view. Let's dance. Let's go for a walk. Oh, what a great view. It's going to be her, though, right? <laughs> I, I know what you're plotting. You get excited by doing perfect stuff and in a group. Front of a great view, don't you? Try to sexually harass me, bringing up such a lame topic, huh? Doy. In that case, the answer is yes. It's a yes? Yeah! Oh my God! Ego, I think I might say something to your personality that you can manage to get all my all the news right on the first try. Dirty mind, stick a leg, and that right, Nico. All right, with that, I think I'm actually done with hers. All right, that's three people down. Oh, Emiko again. For some reason, I'm really bored. All right, let's go to the library and research spells or something. Let's read, let's read a dirty book. Uh, I'm actually kind of curious to pick that <laughs> to see what her reaction would be. But she would be totally pissed by it. Uh, let's read a manga. I don't feel like it. I'm low on mana, so my brain's all fuzzy. They are more considerate than that. Ah, uh, damn it. Or, or actually, no. One of, one of the options was this is boring, right? I should have picked that. That's still over everything she says all the time, right? This is boring. Uh, why did I? Uh, I'm so stupid. I should have immediately picked that. All right, so we're on Gonta's next. Uh, let's look for bugs, of course. Um, Shuichi, you notice Gonta feels sad because there are no bugs anywhere. Thank you, Shuichi. Shu er, thank you, Shuichi is true gentleman. Gonta said there are no bugs Everyone here. Everyone play nice. But as, but as long as Shuichi here, Gonta's sadness will go away. Okay, that was totally obvious, but I appreciate that, Dongaropa. Thank you for today. Gonta glad to spend time with Shuichi. Amazing. So much fun today. And Gonta us also feel closer to being true gentleman. Will you spend time with Gonta again? Watch the documentary of Bugs. Criminal organization is the police. Bugs. Right, come Thank on. Thank you. She wish you remember how much Gonta loved Bugs. If you want to watch Bugs, then she wish you also love, love Bugs. Gonta. Then Gonta tells Shuichi all about Bugs. Again, very obvious one, but you know what? Again, I will take it. Let's play catch. Let's go for a walk. Let's play word chain. No. Uh, let's play, let's play catch. Allow Gonta. Gonta know how to play catch. Gonta play catch with Forrest family. We use season fruit. Fr fruits nice. Fruits and balls. Wait, what? <laughs> fruits go boom, but we threw them real hard. And we all have a good laugh. Oh my God, is he talking about mother flipping football? I'm about to play a game of football. Oh my God. Uh, haven't heard fucking fr football in ages. How did you know I love football so much, Gonta? Now, Shuichi's having the best day ever. Yeah! Shuichi, let's play some fucking football! Yeah, baby! Woo! Uh, uh, we went well. It wasn't amazing. Shuichi! Oh. Shuichi, you want, you're free? You want to suck some dick? Wait, what? Do I want to? What? Let's go to the courtyard. I don't know. Let's get some fresh air. Let's go for a run. Let's go back inside, probably, right? Are you okay? You sure you just want to go back even though we just got here? Like the endorse us fine with me. Try? Let's go back and chat. I've got lots to ask you about Shuichi. Like detective stories or other stuff that help me cosplay detectives. Alright, yes. Uh let's get our bodies moving. Let's clean up a little. I'm tired. Oh, clean up, right? Hmm. Gonta like cleaning. Feels good to move body and Ooh, clean yeah. up. Let's clean everything and surprise everyone. Ah, oh, god damn it. Okay, it must have been move our bodies some. I thought he would say that because he'd be like, because uh, true gentleman clean up after himself or something. Gonta love being gentleman! Uh, okay, let's read a dirty book. Let's read a manga. This is boring. Not, this is boring. I think a dirty book would be right. A manga then? Hmm. Yeah, Gonta like book, books with pictures. Pictures explain complicated stuff easy. Easy for Gonta to Everyone understand. Everyone play nice. Gonta think books like that easy to read because nice people write them. All right, awesome. All right, I think Gonta's good to go now. Oh, no, he's still got one more. All right. It's, okay, maybe it doesn't seem like it's a total one-to-one -one ratio with, like, even when you get a really good response, it doesn't seem to always give you um, a full heart. I don't know. This thing can be kind of confusing. Okay, now he's ready. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to get the next one ready for this this round, but might as well get started on him. Go with Himiko. Okay, this one, I, 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 I've, I, I knew we'd have this option here for this one. I'm tired. It's got to be this one. 
Eh? But you haven't done anything yet. But if you want to rest, I don't mind. But only next time, just because we came to the gym. So I begin to understand magic more and more. Possible to make you my pupil if you really wanted. I fucking knew it. I knew she was she was gonna like that response. Oh, it's got out. Yo! Hey, Switchy! Let's go out and fuck each other. Okay, let's get some fresh air. Let's go for a run. Let's go back inside. Yeah. Just got out here. Why am I going back? Are you tired? Then I'll share some of my magic powder. Yeah. Wait, wait a minute. Is this all part of your plan to get my magic powder? This magic power is super illegal. They got a lot of you. <laughs> what? Is this fucking cocaine? What is this? Is log a longest magical item really necessary? What? That didn't go well. What? No way. What? She won't actually be outside? Oh, I'm so confused. I'm sure she'd be like, let's go back inside and I don't know, magic and tired and shit. Uh, okay, watch an action movie, a comedy, an anime movie. Anime? Hmm. I see, a movie fit for me. It's not a bad idea, but I just go like girl anime are different from reality. Hmm. But I get excited for watching them anyway. I want to be able to transform too. All right, good. All right, it is done. Managed to get four people this time, Monokuma, in your face. That's the 10 days that Monokuma gave us past. The two that fall in love can graduate. Seems that wasn't a lie. Oh! Oh, interesting. Okay, now they're just around. I can just talk to them. Before I left the academy, I decided to talk alone with Kibo. Okay, I don't have to just pick one, do I? I, I hope it's like before where I can I can get every, multiple endings at once. So last day we'll spend in this academy. School life was crazy. But then I think back on it, we had some good times. <sighs> so today is our last day here. It seems so long, yet felt so short. You're right. It's a bit sad, isn't it? Even though we were forced to come here. Yes, I would be lying if I said I did not feel sad about leaving this oh, place. Right. But that sadness is blown away when I think about presenting our plan to the professor. Huh? Our plan? Hey. Have you forgotten the plan that you and I came up with That's... together? Uh, yes, that the plan. The proposal we came up with to present to Professor Udabashi, yes. right? Yes, that's the plan, but you seem somewhat unsure. You do remember the details of our plan, right? Uh, um... uh, of course. Plan Kibo and I came up with. Make more Kibos. Make Kibo, Kibo a giant. Kibo's backstory. If I remember correctly. Your backstory settings, yeah. right? Yes, that's right. In order to achieve even greater heights as a robot, the backstory behind my creation simply will not that's suffice. Right. For example, I could have been kidnapped by an evil organization and turned to a cyborg. That's why we came up with different backstories to present. Uh, um... You want the professor to modify your settings when you get out of here, right? <sighs> yes, that is my intention, but... Huh? What's wrong? Uh... No, it's nothing serious. It's just, as much as I look forward to it, I also feel somewhat worried. Because... It's okay, Kibo. You worked so hard on that. I'm sure the professor will be convinced. Well... If he's still alive. No, it's not that. I'm just a little worried about the modification procedure. What if the modifications turn me into a completely different person? And what if we grow apart because of that? And so we're no longer friends. That's... Kibo. <sighs> oh, I apologize. We're finally about to leave this place, and I'm talking about such a depressing subject. Um, I'm positive the modification will go smoothly. Huh? But, what? I'm... And if something goes wrong, and you're not Kibo anymore, I would still want to be friends, Kibo. So you don't need to worry about that. <laughs> J Sh Shuichi! Aww. Kibo and I embrace tightly. Ah, that's nice! Kibo's a robot. I'm human. But that difference doesn't matter. We're best friends, no matter what. No matter how many times Kibo is modified, even if Kibo isn't Kibo anymore, he will always be my friend. Our relationship began in fiction, but our affection is real. And thus our days at the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles came to an end. Oh! New theme! Love Across the Universe! Yay! Oh, crap. It ended, didn't it? Yes! Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, I was like, please, God, don't make it so I have to... That that would have been a dick move. I have to play through it, like, a million times to get every character's ending. I would have been pissed the fuck off. Let's have a look at my theme, though. Love Across the Universe. Uh, oh, look. It's, oh, I like this one. It's got Shuichi and Kaede there, and then Kurumi and Shimuki and Miyu. Oh, I like this one. I'm going to stick with this one. And this one's actually pretty easy on the eyes, too. Oh, it's so cute. We're all the rocket ships. 
All right, Angie. Before I left the academy, I decided to talk alone with Angie. It's the last day we'll spend at this academy. The school life was crazy, but then I think back on it. We had some good times. What a surprise! I didn't think we'd ever get out of here. Not that I would have minded staying. No. Well, I certainly want to leave. And then? Hey, sweetie, do you remember what you promised me? You promised to become my husband and move to my island to start a divine no. family. Uh, no, I don't think that was a promise. What? Hmm, what do you mean? You are my first. You have become my husband. Huh? Don't tell you... Don't tell... Oh, there's another typo. Don't tell me you forgot that special moment we shared no. together. No, I remember that. Uh, the first she's talking about... Worshipping Angie, her first kiss, getting angry at her. Uh, um, it was the first time anyone scolded you, Angie. Right, you. That's right! The first time I got scolded was by you, Shuichi. I've never been scolded before. It was shocking, really. Sort of turned me on. Never since all I could think about was you. You see? That's why you have no choice but to become my husband, Shuichi. Even a tour says you have no choice. Mm -hmm. But still, getting married. Hmm. Did you not hear what a tour said? Okay. I just can't really think about marriage yet. But, but I do want to spend more time with you, Angie. Huh? Hmm? Do you really? Um, I want to learn about your island. I want to learn about Atua. And more about your tribe of strippers. I want to learn about you. There's still so much I don't know. That's... So, uh, perhaps the marriage can wait until we get to know each other better. Then go back to your island and I'll give you a lap dance. <laughs> Ah, yes! In my culture, a lap dance is the greatest compliment! Somehow, I had a feeling. <laughs> yeah! Atua says it's okay, too! He says he'll watch over us forever. Ah. Angie was blushing, and I felt my own cheeks redden at the sight. And then, Angie and I softly embraced. Oh, that's nice. Although, I can't... I know this is probably asking too much, but I would have loved a little... Just, like, a little picture of him, like, hugging each one of these of his students here. You know how fucking cute that would be? Oh, that would have made me feel so good. That'd be the cutest thing ever. We felt each other's heart, hearts beating so fast. Our relationship began in fiction, but our beating hearts are real. And thus, our days of the ultimate... Yeah, okay. Came to an end. Before I left the academy, I decided to talk alone with Gonta. So the last day we'll spend at this academy. The school life was crazy, but now that I think back on it, we had some good times. Um... Feels like t time flew by. Maybe because Shuichi is here? Gonta has so much fun talking to Shuichi. Time always flies by so okay. fast. I also had fun thanks to you, Gonta. If you weren't around, I wouldn't have been so active and energized. Hmm. Hey, Gonta, what are you going to do when you leave? Gonta do his best. Gonta will keep moving forward. Forward to Gonta's goal! As long as Gonta tries hard, Gonta can reach any goal. Oh, by the way, you guys told me apparently Gonta's, like, backstory is loosely, like, based off of a Street Fighter character. <laughs> what? Seriously? That's why I was, like, battling a whole bunch of dudes. Even, like, some of the, the characters he was describing were characters from Street Fighter. <laughs> what? You guys showed me it's, like, this green goblin thing. I'm not really, like, Street Fighter savvy, so I don't really know what it, I can't remember what his name was, but... <laughs> but like apparently like the green his green skin is supposed to be reference to the the, the quote unquote reptile family of his. Got his goal. What was it again? Uh duh! Capture all the bugs in the world. Become like the become like the wind. We're gonna stop both his families. Uh, um, you want your family to accept your forest family, right? right? Yeah! For that, Gonta's gonna work hard as ultimate entomologist! Forest family is reason why Gonta was able to become ultimate Gonta entomologist. Gonta do his best. If Gonta keeps being ultimate entomologist, <laughs> ultimate entomologist, <laughs> maybe real family will accept Forest okay. family. I know they'll accept them, Gonta. Your talent is truly amazing. After we get out of here, I want to help you with anything you need. Gonta. Shuichi helps Gonta all the time. Gonta is really glad he met Shuichi. If Gonta never met Shuichi, Gonta wouldn't know how to get Forest family accepted. Thank you. To Gonta. Shuichi is truest gentleman there is. Ah. I firmly grasped the hand that was held out to me. Gonda's hand was much bigger than I anticipated. These hands reach out any goal they want to. Oh, I thought for sure he'd give me a fucking bear hug. Come on. Gonda's. I bet Gonda gives great hugs. I'm sure they'll, he'll be able to get his families to reconcile. I can say that with conviction. I'm Gonda's best friend after all. Ah. Yay! I love it all these. Oh my God, Muse. Hey, baby, you ready to go? Full of Sammy decided to talk to me, you. All right. School life was crazy, but now I think back, it's good times. Good times. Aww. 
Stay to the day we finally get out of here, huh? Felt too long, but at the same time, not long enough. Ugh. Can't believe I actually feel sentimental about this shit. So you're capable of feeling sentimental. Psh, I'm super power high tech all made to human, even makes Kibo nervous. She's never gonna give up this up, is she? Still though, so much has happened. I learned so many valuable life lessons. What about you, Pooichi? Yeah, I definitely learned that I have a lot of potential nicknames for my name. Got to be unique people. Not as unique as me, of course, but still. Got to make new ventures and made me frightened of my own abilities. Um. And also, I got to suck your hoge, Shuichi. I got to meet you, That's... Shuichi. Me, you? Um. Uh, oh, do, do you remember? When you received my panties, you also received a special right. Spe <laughs> special right? The right to wear those panties! I'm not gonna say it. The right to date her. <laughs> uh, um, the right to date booyah. you. Booyah! Booyah! All right, good on you for remembering. Want to give me? Want me to give you a prize or reward? Hell yeah! No, no thanks. You know, got dates all over this academy, but still not enough. God, fine. Let's go eat out after this. Oh, uh, you want to go like grab a cheeseburger or something? No, I want you to eat me out. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, Jesus! So many places I want to go with you. Too many to even count. Okay. Yeah. Well, no matter how many dates it takes. I'll keep going until you're satisfied. Um, well, you know how many dates we go on? I'll, I'll never be satisfied. What do you mean? Uh, huh? You're seriously asking me? I, I, I'm saying I want to be with you forever. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. He was blushing, and I felt my own cheeks blush to the rare sight. Miyu and I embraced. The hug was warm and sweet. For Miyu, anyway. Oh, yeah! She was kind of grabbing my ass the whole time. Mm, yeah! Fucking patty cakes! These are mine! These are my patty cakes! Mm. Felt each other's heartbeats beating so fast. Our relationship began in fiction, but our beating hearts are real! Alright, awesome! Okay, time to go work on the other ones.